Today we have a question about uh, <clears throat> composition. We have a question about iconography. Uh, and the question is, with regards to the Sukhavati paintings uh, depicting Amitabha's Pure Land, um, who are the teachers that are depicted in the Namcha tradition composition? So, first of all, it's uh, important to know that with paintings, there's three basic compositions for depicting Amitabha's Pure Land. Uh, the first is a circular format, the second is square format, and then the third is this uh, more unique, more specialized uh, uh, Namcha tradition. So, the question about the teachers. Well, first, what are the main characteristics of the Namcha tradition? How does it vary? Um, uh, having a circular format is understandable and uh, uh, visually obvious, a square format the same. But the Namcha tradition is understood through the different, uh, it's recognized through the different um, uh, additions of uh, figures. So, the main, the main characteristics are Buddha figures in groups. You have the Buddhas of the three times. You have the five symbolic Buddhas, or the Buddhas of the five families. <clears throat> You have the uh, Buddhas of the Ten Directions, and then you have the Buddhas, the six Buddhas of the uh, of the six realms. Aside from that, you can have uh, deity figures such as Vajravahi, Hayagriva, uh, Vajrapani, and uh, Jina Sagara uh, Lokeshvara. But one of the, one of the key elements uh, that you will notice is uh, on either side of Amitabha are an Avalokiteshvara and uh, and uh, a peaceful Vajrapani. The Avalokiteshvara often has four arms, which is a major departure from Mahayana depictions of uh, Bodhisattvas, uh, who are typically human-like, one face, two armed. Now. Along with this, we have uh, typically three figures on either side of the central Amitabha Buddha. Now, these three figures are Tibetan teachers and some Indian teachers, often Nagarjuna. The question is, who are these people? Well, I have not been able to determine exactly who all of them are because they're not consistent with all Sukhavati paintings. Uh, some paintings can have three figures on either side, some can have four. Some Namcha Sukhavati paintings don't have any human teachers, Indian or Tibetan. Some of them are identifiable. Uh, we have Nagarjuna with a, a, a hood of, of snakes above his head. We have a Karmapa. We have what looks like a Gampopa. Sometimes we have a Marpa, who can be confused with a Dromton, so we're not sure who it always is intended to be. So, we don't really know, or I don't really know, who all of these figures are, and, uh, and they're not consistent with the 20 or so Namchu uh, Sukhavati paintings that we have on the Har website. So this is a question that is still uh, pending. Who are the figures in a Nam? Who are the human figures in a Namcha Sukhavati composition?